All right, guys, so Winter Coup, Coats Coup, or even Drip Coup, this man has many names. He is a legend. I'm kidding, but, you know, we got some gameplay here for Winter Coup, and uh, I'm quite excited. His uh, his gameplay looks, you know, very bland because he is a free-to-play, uh, you know, unit, but his actual movesets look actually very interesting. So uh, let's just really quick watch the gameplay, then go over his movesets. How about a friendly round? Yeah! Yeah, I know. Very, very quick and brief. I know. But he is a free to play unit, very much like Drip Vegeta. You know, Vegeta with the coat, the Sab coat. So, you know, this unit here is a free to play unit to go along with the Blizzard theme, whatever's going on. But, you know, the last, um, you know, Free to play Colt Vegeta was actually not that bad. He's actually pretty good um, and he has okay stats. And I expect this character to be, if not exactly up to par with that Vegeta or even better. So, uh, you know, it says here event exclusive Goku is coming. They, they don't use Dripku. Why don't they just use Dripku so people know who he is? I'm kidding. But uh, yeah, it says here from Dragon Ball Super Broly, Goku is winter ready and gear is on the way. Uh, with his main ability, he can steal up to two Dragon Balls from the enemy. Now, this is going to be fun. The amount of, uh, you know, uh, you could probably even put him in the leader slot alongside uh, Demi King Piccolo, Zenkai Demi King Piccolo, and you can literally just steal up to four Dragon Balls. That's going to be so annoying. I'm actually going to try this out for sure and let you guys know how it all goes. But um, yeah, that's going to be really annoying. Uh, double rising rush for sure. Um, you know, it says here he also has high damage cuts and can increase allies damage inflicted. So he's either going to be a a support unit or a defensive type of unit. I'm leaning a little bit more towards a support unit just because we see that he steals Dragon Balls and he increases allies damage inflicted. He does have damage, uh, high damage cuts, uh, which might include him being a defensive unit. But I think he's just going to be an um a support uh supportive type of unit now really quick this is the unit we got last time and uh you know he was actually quite impressive if you look at his stats he is a range type uh you know unit and we don't know what color drip is gonna be but you know we can go off with some estimates in just one bit but we see here his blast attack is pretty notable at 250 you know his strike defense is you know okay everything's okay this guy is a free-to-play unit very much like drip uh drip -Ku. So I'm expecting somewhat the same around, like somewhat, you know what? I'll probably expect the stats to be slightly lower, but the kit to be much, much better. But this guy's kit is really good as well, guys. I mean, he has, uh, you know, uh, his blast, I think he's, uh, not his blast damage, there we go. His, um, you know, his super does a lot of damage, his special move. Uh, you know, when you pop your main ability, it's 50 extra percent damage. So this guy actually has pretty, you know, he actually has a pretty solid kit. I used him a lot at that time. And he has quite the interesting Z ability. His Z ability is nothing to do with sagas at all. Apparently, you know, it's just Vegeta clan, uh, max health up to 20%, which is really good. If you guys want to build up a little cool showcase about health and stuff like that. But, you know, we have this right here and sagas, to be honest, we can sit here and guess his color all day long, but I'll tell you what, I don't think he's going to be red. I'll just say that because, or purple, I'll just say red and purple. Everything else is up for, uh, for grabs. Uh, I'm going to say it's not going to be red because we have drip Vegeta and they're not going to make them identical colors. And as well as, I don't think they're going to make them purple, uh, just because, you know, Super Saiyan God, uh, you know, LF, Super Saiyan Blue and, um, Goku and Vegeta are both purple. Now, everything else could be up for grabs. You know, we have a yellow, we even have a blue, we have a, we have a red fused with nail, um, you know, uh, just just literally pickle fused with nail just came out right now. So, um, everything else, maybe, I would say if we have to take out yellow and blue, purple and red, that will leave us with green, but then we just got this Broly. So, I think maybe even blue. I'm leaning towards blue. That Vegeta's, I mean, that Goku's probably gonna be blue. And, uh, you know, like I said, it could be anything because after that, or oh, actually, it might even be blue because this Broly and Chila is also going to get a Zenkai. You know, I think uh, today is two. Okay, so tomorrow's Tuesday, technically Tuesday for some of you guys. We should see this Zenkai Broly and Chila assist. Uh, if not this weekly reset, the next, I'm leaning more towards the next. And then after that is when they're going to start hinting huge stuff for Christmas slash New Year's because that's going to cover absolutely everything they covered in the videos and stuff. So we're going to, you know, we already saw, you know, all the, 
pretty much like brand new LFs already for the Super Saiyan Blue Goku and Vegeta. We saw Sword of Hope Trunks. You know, we also saw, you know, Super Vegito Zenkai. Now we're seeing Dripku. And then next, we're, we're, uh, we're pretty much just going to see Broly and Chilai. And then after that, you know, I think they're definitely going to start dropping some brand new stuff or the second half of the anniversary. But guys, you know, I am I am going to farm him. I am going to try him out alongside this Drip Vegeta for sure. That's just going to be really cool just to maybe, you know, run both of these together simultaneously. That'd be really cool. Uh, but, you know, there's not much else to go off of here, guys. And something I've mentioned before, let me go uh, to this guy's page. Uh, his name is Spoon. No, 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 no. I don't want to tap something. His name is Spoon on um, Spoon. I don't know. Spoon. I think his name is Spoon. There we go. This is the guy right here, guys. So this guy, he pretty much just leaked something um, on which one call it. He's pretty much. I'm just trying to find. It. He has a whole bunch of like kind of like mini little hacks. Uh, I would say, but he leaked, there we go. He leaked this right here. Now we all know the, that certain LFs have unique uh, gauges, right? So like UI Goku has a uh, vanish one or a kind of dodging one, which equals to this one. And then this, I believe is Trunks's. Then we also have cells in here somewhere, but there's one that hasn't came out yet, guys. And I've mentioned this previously on my last video. But you guys can see clearly here that this is one that we have not seen for a unique uh, gauge for a unit. Now, a lot of people might be saying this might be UI Goku's fist, uh, MUI Goku's fist when he punches Jiren. Maybe it's Jiren because it's red. I don't think it has anything to do with that. I think it's just a logo. But something to note on this specific uh, unique gauge logo um, thing is that he says right here it's labeled attack. So all the others are not labeled attack and this is labeled attack and it's currently being unused. So, you know, whether or not that's going to come during this celebration, that's up for discussion. I'm, I'm not quite sure, but if it's already in the game, if you guys ask me, um, that's a really good sign that it should be coming soon. But if this is an attack, because if you guys just look right, if he says it's labeled attack, but this you guys can clearly see that it's it's like it's a dodge. It's UI Goku, right? And this right here, you guys can clearly see that it is a defensive type of um, unique gauge for trunks. And then I believe this is cell. I, I think this is cells, but you know, none of them are labeled. This one's labeled attack. So maybe our first ever unique gauge attack. That'd be really, really cool. Maybe it's like a green card uh, on the side, but you tap on the, the icon. That'd be really cool. Maybe like a, U, a MUI Goku one where, you know, he just kind of does that huge punch uh, and he gets crazy, crazy buffs. That'd be really cool. But Guys, you know, that's pretty much just going to cover up the video. Um, you know, Dripku, nothing too special here in terms of the gameplay. But he is a free unit, and it's just really cool. He doesn't go Super Saiyan Blue just yet. But, you know, I hope that, you know, down the line they do implement that. But, guys, that's going to wrap up the video. And I'll definitely catch you guys tomorrow for some leaks. Have a good one. Peace.